Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh And very good morning Maybe morning, maybe evening, maybe afternoon Maybe good night Dr. Norlida binti Hassan So today our group will present about flood forecasting model using fuzzy inference system So for the first one is uh, our team member which is me Muhammad Zaim Rashidan Biru Samadi and then the second one is Muad Abdul Malik Abdul Mur Abdullah Murshid and then Ahmad Shahmi bin Badr Sham then Muhammad Najmi bin Yahya and then Muhammad Rafi bin Misham and then Ahmad Idlan bin Azmi So this is our team member and then for the introduction uh, for the for our for our project which is FIS is the most critical and demanding operation for the hydrologist. So it is critical because an effective flood forecasting system will significantly improve public safety and then encourage management of reservoir and mitigate flood damage. And then the issue that exists in the conventional approach is the inevitable update in field implementation where the configuration of the model need to be rebuilt and then the parameter need to be recalibrate even though only one data item is adjusted or add to the database so in this in this introduction we will include FEIS which is fuzzy exemplar based inference system in this FEIS it conclude two which is uh, two algorithm which is hyper rectangle exemplar added builder which is each and then the fuzzy inference system each is an algorithm of categorization analogous to the concept of learning by example which is same as n and then uh, FIS is fuzzy rule based system a non-linear mapping of given input vector to a scalar output vector using uh, fuzzy logic which is a fuzzy inference system and then the purpose of this paper is to suggest a novel model called the fuzzy exemplar based inference system for flood forecasting to overcome this weakness and then in our proposed FEIS system is serve as a set of rule that is transform which appropriate membership function into a set of fuzzy if then rule and then the fees will provide an inference engine to formulate the relationship between input and the output the system is designed to take advantage of simple algorithm and powerful performance in classification and fuzzy reasoning by fusing this algorithm, each and FIS, and promote its accuracy over time as more information is, proce is processed. This system applied during flood event in Malaysia Kelantan River Basin to predict stream, stream flow one hour ahead. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Ahmad Shahmi bin Badrul Hisham. Uh, uh, it is my turn to present about my, our project. Uh, for my part is related words. Uh, for the first first part in related word is fuzzy logic control. Fuzzy logic, which is the logic on which fuzzy control is based, is far closer in spirit to human thought and natural language than conventional logical systems. In this perspective, the fuzzy logic controller FLC essential part is a set of linguistic control rules related to the dual concept of fuzzy involvement and the rule of inference composition. For the second part in related work is fuzzification. Fuzzification requires requires two processes which is for the first specifying and translating the input for the second translating the input and output variables the diagram shows is fuzzy fuzzy inference system for the input is fuzzification interface for knowledge base uh, there is two knowledge base which is database and rule base and for the output is the defazification it will be go to decision making unit that's all for me okay for the methodology for this project we had used one specific technique to make sure all the tasks for this project can be done so the center of defazification method 
has been used because this operator assure a linear interpolation of the output between rules. A, de a defasication technique is where the data are performed by the coordinators of the center for the gravity of the level section. Defasication is realized by decision making algorithm that select the best scripts value based on a fuzzy set. It also includes uh, several items, for example, uh, me membership principles, centroid method, center, uh, center of sums, center of largest area. Okay, next for the methodology, this is the system analysis, which is the input for this project is river level and rainfall. The fuzzy controller or the fuzzy for, uh, for the process is fuzzification, fuzzy arithmetic and rules and the output which is flat status. Next for the linguistic variable, there is a input and output which is the input is rainfall and river level. For rainfall, have variable which is low, moderate and heavy. For the river level, have variable which is normal, berjaga, amaran and bahaya. The output is flood status which is the variable is no flood, minor flood, moderate flood and major flood. Uh, as you can see, this is the input variable for river level which is normal, berjaga, amaran and bahaya. There is point from 0 until 1 that show in the membership function so this is the membership function for river level and then the membership function for rainfall and last the membership function for flood status the output for this project so that's all for the methodology next for the implementation Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and uh, now I'm going to explain about the implementation and result of the MATLAB program. Uh, at the beginning we can see that we have uh, two inputs over here and one output over there. Uh, the first input is rainfall, the second one is rebel level. Then the output is flood status. Let's go deeper to the first input. We can see that we have a three member uh, shape function uh low moderate heavy and all of them the type is trim f and the params is as shown here and the range is 0 to 300 uh the second uh input is variable level we have four membership function normal brijaga amaran bahaya uh also all of them the, the type is trim f and the params as it's shown here 0, 1, 2, and the range is 0, 5. And now let's go to the uh, output. Uh, the output we have uh, also a uh, four uh, membership function. Uh, we have uh, three of them, uh, they are at, at, uh, trap MF, and one of them, which is this one, trim F. Mm, uh, and the range is from 0 to 10. Okay, uh, here we can see the input models and the output fuzzy function are obtained using a simple F and L. So we have here 12 uh, logic condition using the F and L. Uh, now we, we will go to the rules that we had made. Uh, here is the rules. We can see that the rainfall is equal to 150, uh, rebel level is 2.5, and flood status will be what? 3.62. Uh, let's change the uh, input to 100 example and uh, 1.5. Now the flood status the output will be changed uh, according to the two inputs. And it is 2.5 and so on to the to any other uh, range of the input 
Uh, now we go to the surface. As we can see, here is the uh, surface, uh, the flood status. This is the output, and this is the first, in, uh, the first input and the second input. Uh, so uh, the criteria, the output value for fuzzy logic control for flood prediction is obtain the surface for visualized output plot of the fuzzy system. Example of result that rainfall and travel level could obtain in rule viewer. The surface shows that the input and output relationship as determined by fuzzy interface uh, unit. The result shows the way that a uh, machine will respond in fuzzy logic control. So uh, the output result will be shown based on the input range for each type. All right, for the conclusion for, the, for this project, uh, in summary, this project is discussing about the flood forecasting for the Kelantan River in Malaysia. This project also used the fuzzy logic approach for the real-time flood forecasting by applying the method which is using the minimum implication function from the Mamdani fuzzy inference method. This, uh, the purpose of the project is to, to, su to suggest a novel model that called the fuzzy uh, exemplar based inference system or if EIS for flood forecasting the methodology for this project is Mamdani fuzzy inference so that the, the flood forecasting that have been developed can be used uh, for the people to make prediction about the flood in the future for the future works this project can be improved by adding more uh, attributes or data from the flood database so i think that's all from us thank you